So here we go. It's five minutes of sudden death OT. Both teams, as Tom mentioned earlier, 0-0-1 in the extra period this year. Stars three and the Blackhawks three. Brought Duchesne and Gartner to Nordy and Murphy to start off the overtime for Minnesota. And here we go. Hartson knocked out of the way by Duchesne. Gartner, Hulk clear by Creighton at neutral. Gartner again. A block out of Nope. Carried over the line. Through. Broken up. A blast by Russell. The score. Northwestern wins it in overtime on a blast by the line. Eight seconds of overtime. And the Blackhawks have won it four to three. Well, I never got a chance to say that usually the goals in overtime are scored in the first minute or it goes the full five minutes. And Doug Wilson, spotting an opportunity to move up, came back and Chicago scored the last four goals of this game and they win it four to three. And Doug Wilson scoring his only even strength goal of the season so right, far. That's right. At five in the power play before. We'll try to pick it up with the face off. It only won 18 seconds. Pierre not very happy. You can see the puck very seldom left the North Star zone at all. Passing was a little bit off there. It was kind of bouncing a little bit. And watch right here. Everyone is there trying to pick it up, but can't quite get to it. And finally, the pass coming across. Gardner not able to get a piece of it. And it's just bounce, bounce, bounce as Gardner trying to handle it with his hand, unable to do so. And the puck goes off a skate. It's a game of inches. And believe me, that shot coming in from Wilson. He he had it labeled all the way. He knew what he wanted to do. He was not so much looking where the puck was going as trying to overpower the goaltender and catch him on a quick shot. It caught the inside of the pad of goaltender Kari Taco, and that's the final. 4-3 to three, Chicago. Oh, they love Doug Wilson in that big, big shot of his. Noonan gets the only assist. Sixth goal of the year for Wilson. And it's over in overtime. The final, the Hawks four and the North Stars three. The loss for the North Stars, the game was just over. Four, three in overtime, the Blackhawks over the North Stars. The regular season may not mean all that much, but you don't have to be a hockey purist to enjoy a game as exciting as this one was. This smacked of an April playoff game. 37-year-old Helmut Balderas from Latvia scored his first NHL goal. If you listen to longtime announcer Al Shaver, he says Balderas has the best hands he's ever seen in hockey. Imagine what this guy was like in his prime. The Stars led 3-0. The Hawks, who lead the Norris division, got all out and went all out at home. Dirk Rand, there, used to play for the Stars, got the Hawks on the board. And it was up and down all night, and just seconds ago, watch what happens. The puck is getting kicked all over the place, but Doug Wilson, with that blistering shot... Fade like a pair of blue jeans meeting bleach. We pick it up with the Stars leading 1-0. On the breakaway, it's Helmut Balderas. That's right, the 37-year-old from the Soviet Union gets his first NHL goal. Perestroika, alive and well in the NHL. Second period on the power play. Neil Broughton, and Neil puts the Stars in command. Three zip. But the Hawks came back with the next three goals. This one to tie it. Steve Larmer getting it past Kari Taco. It goes to overtime, tied at three. 18 seconds into the overtime. Doug Wilson will wind up with the big slap shot, get it past Taco, and Chicago wins it in overtime. 4-3, a tough loss for the Stars.